Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Jukes222. Welcome to another video. Uh, today we are back in the coach squad, ranked 86, so up one rank from yesterday. But unfortunately, we do have another tough match in front of us against a league has no name. This is a rematch from two days ago. They're ranked 17. Um, so today we are we are actually doing pretty well. Like we're, what is that, 57 points behind? And um, three drives in hand. So if I can get three TDs here, we'll be only down by three TDs in a bit. Which is definitely a reasonable margin just over halfway through the match. So today we are already we are going to take on a 128 defense here. I have already um, saved and exited on him, so there's no le need to call him out in my lead chat. And also one more thing of business. Um, I'm probably going to be posting this after the stream tonight, but there will be a stream on Saturday at 9 p.m. Eastern doing the tournament. Um, tonight was probably just head-to-head uh, -head grinding, but I'm recording this before the stream so anyway let's hop into the drives so one of the benefits to saving and um to saving and exiting is that you have a two next to your name for the number of drives left um so chances are you can get th through two drives um easily uncountered so or by uncountered i mean like without a live counter so right there, so we had the ultimate win free stadium, kick was short, I fair caught it, and uh, you see them pick it up. That's why you fair catch those short kicks. So anyway, um, Lynn in my league told me that they, no one has countered strong IPFL middle, so we will go with that. Not countered, so the two reads here, going to be Graham on the deep ball if you get a broken coverage, but the main read is just going to take the free scramble to the right side. Unfortunately, that defense is really fast. Graham didn't get open enough. But anyways, second down, we will use... Um, let's go with Trips, Tie, and Quick Slants. Unfortunately, this is carry when we get this nickel zone. Um, so we are probably just going to gun it to Graham here. Which we get it off. Sets up a third and eight. From the right hash with scramble, we're probably going to... Yeah, let's go motion cross here. Fortu unfortunately, this is countered, so we're going to try to hit wide receiver 2. Hopefully, it's not high snap critical. Anything else, I think I'll be able to get first down. Even with the high snap critical, we were able to get the first down, and that was a 100% counter. Since PFL middle was open, I'm going to run PA slide. Unfortunately, this is counter formation when we get this 3-4 uh, zone here. Um, so on counters, we're going to look to hit the deep drag. But normally, you'd look to hit the fullback first and then the deep drag. So this is not countered. Fullback's open. We're going to take it. Do a little, do a little in and out weaving. We're up to the... What is that? We're in opponent's territory, which is good. Um... I'm going to stay away from the free scramble plays because the defenses are just way too fast. As I'm playing a 1 2 8, we're going to go bunch Z cross in. Dime man coverage. So, who we're going to look to here is wide receiver 2 on his out route. Makes a grab. We are up to the 25 yard line. Can we recycle anything? Yep, we can recycle. PAFL middle. Here it goes. Unfortunately, this is countered when we get this 3-4 coverage, or possibly countered. The Bucks are a 3-4 team, so this doesn't mean it's countered, and we're just going to go through the same reads. Unfortunately, we do get hit with that 4% counter. Just threw it away as we did not have anything. We cannot recycle. We're going to need a new second down play here, and that play is going to be flipped spread at five drag. Get this 3-4 zone. Going to hit Graham when he goes on his out route. Three-man blitz. We hit Graham. Third. Sets up a third in inches. Um, motion cross was hard counter, so can't recycle that. We are going to flip. Weak eye fullback dive. Just hopefully get enough for the first. Oh, we just get clobbered. Fourth and two. Let's check if it's a short two or a long two. 
Unfortunately, I think that looks like a long two. Um, but I think we will still be able... Let's see if we have anything to recycle. We will use that. No, nope, not using PA slide here. So we are going to go with weak ID curls, even though it will not draw goal line. Because we will just, the read here is just going to be the same as a goal line weak die deep curls where you just scramble left. So we get the edge. We are in goal line. Going to flip full back flare. And we take that in for the touchdown. Going to have to go toss here. Uncountered. Hopefully uh, the defense is not too fast for me. We get huge blocks and we're in for our first eight points. So going to start it out with Bunchy crossing as he is most, most likely, if he were to put one game plan in, uh, he would put the PA slide plus, plus PA FL middle game plan. So going to start with Bunchy crossing to test the live counter here. Looks like we're not going to want a fair catch at one. I kind of misread it. Luckily, it bounced way far back. Gonna go bunch Z here. Get this diamond or er, yeah, diamond coverage. So we're gonna look to wide receiver two on the out route. Makes a grab. First down. Gonna flip PA slide. Not countered. Same reads. Deep drag route. Flat route. Get a huge block there. We also get Graham for the first down. Gonna go PFL middle, possibly countered, but Bucks are a 314. Gonna look to either the tight end or scramble here. Jeez, and that defense is just incredibly fast. Sets up a second down. FL drag was open. This is counter formation. This will be counter because the only time where uh, spread FL drag draws dime man uncountered is in um, is in third and long situation. So. This will be countered. We get it off. And it looks like we are going up against a live counter. So this is probably a softer live counter as my three first down plays were open. So I'm not going to try to change the script too much. I think he might have took motion cross out, but hmm, is it worth the shot? You know what? I have a good play. We are going to go with Bunch Flanker Drive here. Unfortunately, this is counter formation. Doesn't mean it's countered though. So the read here on um, on uncountered is either to, we're probably just going to scramble left, but if it is countered, we're going to try to get a pass off to our wide receiver one. Unfortunately, Bunch Flanker was 100%. It's going to set up a fourth and 10 here. We could recycle cross in. Ah, uh, you see, I'm I'm kind of torn here because I don't think Bunch Z is reliable for 10 yards consistently, especially when you get like a deep zone coverage. I'm thinking you I might have to test motion cross here because he might have pulled that out. Definitely a tough spot here, but I think we are going to risk it with motion cross. You get this dime man coverage, double wide. So normally on third downs on double wide motion cross, we're going to hit the tight end on that um, kind of curl, big post route kind of thing. But since this is fourth down, chances are we will just scramble. The only thing I'm worried about here is if the def defensive end takes like a wide sort of angle and that will delay our scramble time. So hopefully the defense or hopefully our, our people get our blocks. Oh, that defense was quick, but we barely just got enough. That is a big first down. Going to go PA slide as it is more reliable. Graham's going to get open. Hit him. Should we go bunch Z or FL middle? Haven't really had much success with FL middle. You know what? Let's just go bunch Z. Possibly countered when we get this dime zone. On counters, you're going to hit wide receiver one. And on uncounter formations, you're going to hit 
Tyree Kill, you're gonna be t you're gonna it's gonna be told whether it's a counter if you get the auto drop back or not. So no auto drop back, no counter. Gonna hit our slot. For unfortunately, he can't hang on to the ball. Um, so spread FL drag was countered. Not really liking FL middle here. Since he pulled motion cross, he might have pulled quick slants, but but can I test quick slants? It's tough. Um, yeah. So they are just raving on me right now. I think for my motion cross call. Think about running quick slants here. Um yeah let's go with a little yeah I think we're going quick slants unfortunately we do get countered this nickel zone but I think if it's not high snap critical we can get it away still hard countered though sets up a third and long without scramble I think I'm gonna go to my lead chat here um and kind of defer to them so I will be back um so yeah all right guys so we are back finally have a play call after like I don't know five to ten minutes of deferring the play call here is going to be flip smash so essentially why we chose smash is because it pairs with cross in as a counter and uh, it does have a good corner route and a curl route option just see this we get man coverage here um so the reads here are going to be either tyree kill your slot receiver on the corner route or jerry rice your wide receiver one on the curl route just gonna hit the curl here gonna be safe so it's up a fourth and eight time for motion cross get the same diamond coverage this time it's not double wide so we're gonna hope that the dn takes a straight line to my O tackle and we will roll out to the left oh this is great perfect and we are in for the touchdown that is awesome toss countered unfortunately and we we have nowhere to go but very happy to get that second touchdown smart play call by Ozzy smart execution by me taking the curl route instead of forcing it to the corner route so anyways, I am going to be on a live counter extraordinaire here. So because I took so long, but anyways, going to return middle. And I think we're, we're just going to completely change the script here. Going to fair catch it again. Oh, that was close. Really close. Oh my God. Those, that, that is just real tough. So anyway, we're going to try to PA cheese him now because he probably countered all of my other plays. Or should I test cross in? It, it can break hit criticals a little bit. Let's not assume the live counter. Let's turn off with cross in here. Okay, get this dime man where we're going to hit the out route. Got this coverage uh, the third time in a row now. So we, um, so we're up for first down. I'm gonna test slide because he doesn't seem to counter these plays. Okay, there's the hard counter. So he has slide with FL middle. Second and fourteen here. We are going to go, um, with a powerful play. We were actually FL drag was hard countered, so I'm kind of hesitant to run shallow cross here. Um, don't really want to run against this defense. Um, empty stick's a good option. Let's go empty stick. Oh, dime zone, so potentially countered. If it is countered, we're going to try to get it to four net. But if it isn't countered, we're still going to go to four net. Yep, countered. And incomplete. Oh, 6%. That is brutal. Um, But since empty stick was open, I think... We are going to go with Trip Strong Flood here, as Empty Stick does pair with Trip Strong Flood. Trip Strong Flood has a really nice 10-yard out route. 
get get dime zone, so not counter count formation is nickel zone. Uh, reads here are going to be your slot receiver first, and then you're going to look to your tight end. Please, oh, fourth and short. I don't know whether to test it, test it with deep curls or not because he may have saw that as my fourth down goal line play. You know what we're going to do? We're going to run a variation of deep curls. We're going to run weak eye triple post. Weak eye triple post is going to be the same reads as deep curls. Step, uh, it, yeah, you're going to scramble left. Get a huge block there and pick up the first. So we get that big first down. Can We can recycle Bungie, so we will do that. Oh, nickel coverage. Nickel coverage slot receiver is going to get wide open, so hopefully we get him here. There it is. Makes a grab. We are in for the final touchdown. Going to have to use toss here. Oh. And we, unfortunately, cannot get in for the two-point conversion. But I will take 20 points on the day. Um, definitely. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure uh, to hit that like button. Make sure to comment. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit the notification icon so for some more of my three touchdown performances and 24 performances. But anyway, my name is Jukes222. Have a great Thursday night and take care.